Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Rebecca and today I'm doing a Degusta box unboxing. It's one of my favorite boxes to unbox ever because it is filled with food. It's filled with snack sizes, it's filled with full sizes, it's filled with deluxe sizes, and I love it. I am sent to this I am sent this free for review, so let's get into it and see what I can eat. And these boxes are heavy and always come really well packed. So the first thing it says is Seasons Eatings, which is a cute little sticker. Let's eat. Okay. Just keep in mind, I am a very picky eater, but don't worry, none of this ever goes to waste because if I don't eat it, I have family that will definitely eat it. My uncle eats everything, so um, I was offered to my husband, and then my dad, and then my mom, and then my uncle, and he eats everything so nothing ever goes to waste just keep in mind that is on me it's not on the box so i did peek and there's quite a few things in here i will not be eating but um let's see if i can taste a couple things on camera with you guys so the first thing i am pulling out is oven baked breadsticks with green olives and black olives i've had these before not this flavor but i don't like olives so this is something i will be passing on to one of them and i'll let you know what they think of it. Everything in my last unboxing that I did not eat, my uncle ate, my mom ate, my dad ate. They all loved everything. So this is a great box. It's $19.99 a month. I have a code that will save you half price. So you're getting way more than $10 worth of food in here and you're getting way more than $20. So if you can get it for $10, get your first box, get it for $10. But these are the breadsticks full size by Barilla. And there should be a card in here somewhere that has all the pricing on it. I think I just I opened up my box upside down so um, it's usually right on top but I think it's gonna be right on bottom the next thing we have is root for the beet flavored with balsamic vinegar and sea salt a baked snack with a tangy twist um, these are good things I don't like beets and I hate vinegar if something has vinegar in it other than barbecue sauce I probably won't like it I don't like ketchup I don't like salt and vinegar chips I don't eat pickles it's like this is gonna be passed on. If you guys are curious about any of the products that I'm showing you, ask me in the comments below and I'll let you know what my mom and my uncle, my husband and my dad all thought of it. So just leave me a comment. Hopefully we can try something in here. All right, the next thing came very well wrapped, big glass jar, and it is pickles, which I'm not gonna eat, but it's called Sucker Punch Gourmet Pickles. They had a spoiler, um, kind of a clue, and it was Tommy Pickles sucking on a sucker. And everyone thought that it was going to be like pickle flavored, flavored lollipops or the new Reptar bar. But it's sucker punch pickles for Tommy Pickles eating a sucker. but Which is clever, but, 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 but not going to be eating pickles. My husband likes pickles, so I'll see if he likes these. But that seems really cool. It seems like these are going to be pretty expensive. I'll find that, I'll see if I still have that card somewhere. And I'll go over pricing with you guys in just a minute. Always really well wrapped. The next thing is Barilla Ready Pasta, Gemelli Al Dente Perfecting Pasta, 60 seconds. This I will definitely eat. Can't really taste it on camera with you guys right now because it needs to be microwaved and I'm not hungry right now. But I will definitely eat this. I am someone who likes to have really quick food. Um, I don't spend a lot of time cooking in the kitchen, so this will be really good for me to have. Next thing, looks like it's some pasta sauce to go with the pasta, and it is, it is pesto, sun-dried tomato pe pesto. That looks good, I will definitely eat that with that pasta. Um, and it's funny, I was watching Jessica Braun or Jam89, and she had pesto in one of her vlogs, and she was saying that she likes it heated up, and she always gets made fun of her heating it up, because people are like, you're supposed to eat pesto cold, but... Uh, if she doesn't heat it up, I want to try to heat it up, <laughs> but it doesn't say to heat it. So, personal preference, try it both ways, but I'll definitely eat that on my pasta. And I thought this was going to be my form, but I did get a coupon for one free package of any Osiri bakery morning rounds or snacking rounds. So, I have never seen the, this brand in Walmart, so I'm going to have to Google them or email them and see where I can buy their product locally. I do live in a small town in Oklahoma, but even the Walmart's 20 minutes away, so hopefully I can find these somewhere close to where I live. 
If not, when does it expire? Not, it doesn't expire for another year, which is a good coupon because it gives me time if I go to Dallas or into Arkansas or into Oklahoma City or something, I can take my coupon with me and find it in a larger metropolitan area. All right. Here is the, here is the December box um, information sheet. So let's go over some pricing real quick. The pickles are $5.99, so I knew those were gonna be expensive. That's a big, heavy glass jar. This is $2.99. This was $1.99. The Good Thins are $2.49. And the Breadsticks are $3.99. So definitely over 10 and probably close to, if not over 20. And we still got a couple of things in here. So it looks like we have a entire recipe book from Brianna's, which makes me think there's gonna be a salad dressing in here. We got a Brianna's salad dressing a few boxes back. That was really, really good. It was like um, cilantro, oh yeah, it was this one. The cilantro lime one, that was really good. And what I would do is I would make um, boneless, skinless, boneless skinless grilled chicken with black beans and rice, corn, and then cook that together and keep it in the fridge and then whenever I was ready to eat pour a little bit of this over it it was so good I didn't even need to heat it up or anything I would make it like I would eat it like cold um, and it was really good so hopefully we have that cilantro lime again but probably not because they like to send a variety of things um, so this is a really cool book all about uh, all about the dressing and ways to incorporate it so. there's also a coupon on sucker punch pickles so if you like it, you can save $2 off your next purchase. So if my husband likes it, I'll buy it for him again because $6 for a jar of pickles, if I can get it for four, that's better. And that coupon doesn't expire for two years, so that's a good coupon. Okay, let's keep going and see. The next thing we have in here is a Biashi Hazelnut and Choc Cocoa Cream Sandwich Cookie, also by Barilla. Looks like Barilla is in this box a lot. These are $2.99. Let's try it. I'm not the hugest fan of um, hazelnuts. I don't eat a lot of nuts, but since it's like a spread, um, it should probably be good. And I know a lot of people love Nutella, so it's just not something I got into. So, But I do like sweets. I like my sweets. So let's see if I can open these first. These are $2.99. And let's see if I can open them first. And then I can taste them for you guys. Play some music. Do, 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 do. Okay. They smell good. This is what they look like. These are really good. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. mm. those are really good so I will definitely be eating those those are really good they're they have a lot of cookie to cream ratio but the cookie is really good and the cream had a good flavor to it but it wasn't like a lot of cream all right here's the dressing it actually has a uh, a little lid on it this time so this is creamy balsamic dressing I don't think I'm gonna like this so I will take this to my mom's house and try it on salad with her probably but this is the Brianna's and it is $3.99 so I don't think I'll like it because it's balsamic vinegar but I'll try it I'm just not gonna try it right now and then it looks like the last things that we got in our box is Cali rice and this is rice made out of cauliflower so it's a little bit more it's lower calorie and it's supposed to be more of like a healthy alternative and we have spicy chicken artificially flavored lower calorie rice alternative so on here it says 61 fewer calories than white rice on my paper it actually says 75 percent fewer calories than normal white rice so Kind of a different number there. We have spicy chicken and we have original. So I'll definitely try these out. 
and these are $2.99 each. It also says on here that your box will contain one of the pictured varieties, but I got two. So I don't know if that's because I reviewed the box for them or not, but let me know what you guys thought. I'm sorry that this was kind of a disappointing box for me because there was a lot of things that had vinegar in it <laughs> and a lot of things I'm not too thrilled about eating. So um, again, that's on me, not on them. So sorry if you guys wasted your time watching this. I hope you guys have a wonderful night, and I will see you guys soon. Bye, guys.